Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Sick Eric back again with another video and today we are going over the nav bar and gestures on the OnePlus 6T and how to use them and what each one does. So um, the OnePlus 6T has several different options as far as your navigation bar and different gestures and that is the cool thing I like about this phone is that it gives you options. Uh, it implements the traditional style, the pill style, and the gesture style from OnePlus. So with that being said, let's go ahead and jump into the settings. Mm -hmm. And then you're gonna want to go to, you're gonna wanna go to buttons and gestures. And then you're gonna go into nav bar and gestures. And it gives you three different options. You could choose from traditional, the pixel style, and OnePlus's uh, navigation gestures. So if you go into traditional, it brings up your buttons right here at the bottom and then you could also customize it you could swap them back and forth the back button and then swap it that way you also have long press and double press on the um, options right here so say on the home button if you want to long press to lock the screen, to lock your phone you long press and you have it unlocked and then you could also uh, do double tap action for uh, the same options, open shelf, open and close uh, notification center, open, close, split screen, and your menu and all of that. So it's really, really nice. You can set these for each one of these, the recent, back, and the home. So uh, long press, we're going to keep that search assistance because I really don't use the nav bar. And then uh, you could also hide the nav bar up here. You click that, it gives you this little dot down in the corner. So you click it and you are now able to hide the nav bar. The second option you have is the back and home. Now this is the uh, pixel style um, type of nav bar to where you swipe up and then it gives you all your different recent menus. And you could also use the pill to slide on over through them all right there. So that's really, really cool. I like this uh, a lot better. You click home, swipe up, go back. And then you could also just slide through them as well just by sliding the uh, pill from anywhere you are. And you could also switch the button, the back button to the right side or the left side if you please. And you also have the long press and double action, tap actions on the home button and the back button. And you don't have them on the recent button since it is grayed out and it doesn't have a recent button. So the next one we have is the nav navigation gestures now this one there is nothing on here it gives you a little introduction on it recent apps you swipe hold up and it brings you to your recent apps click on that and then to go back you swipe either from the right click on that or you swipe from the left and you can go back and forth between all your stuff and then you swipe up to go home so this one is really nice. I'm kind of switching between the Pixel and this one a lot because um, this one is just really easy and it gives you more screen um, real estate on your device. But I do like the uh, nav bar gestures at the back and the home from the Pixel style. It just looks a lot cooler to me and it looks more pixelish uh, to me as well. So I really like that one a lot. And... Um, as far as that goes, you also have quick gestures, which uh, allows you to double tap to wake the screen, uh, draw two to control music, and then if you want to draw either O, V, S, M, or W on your screen, you could launch certain apps. So like say I, if I draw an O on the screen, it launches the camera, which is really, really nice features. If you draw a V, it'll launch the flashlight. You could also set these to custom apps if you please so if you want to open up Facebook by drawing something uh, drawing an M you could do so you could do different actions up here shortcuts so it's a really really nice feature OnePlus is really cool about all of these quick gestures and the features and everything so I'm really liking that about this device I've never owned a OnePlus device this is my first one so I'm really enjoying all of these uh, different features on here and in buttons and gestures you also have alert slider which is a slider down here uh, you could click to uh, silent 
uh, you can click to vibrate and it gives you options and then ring also vibrate for calls and what this does is when you slide the alert slider on the side right here you can hit silent you can do vibrate and you can do ring which is really really nice I really like this alert slider it's pretty cool sort of like what you have on the iPhone uh, but this one gives you more options the iPhone is either just off and on type thing but um, other than that these are the navigation buttons and gestures on the OnePlus 6T um, they are really nice they're really customizable and if you have this device then you can check these out and play with them if you don't have the device and you're thinking about getting the device um, and you're not sure about these gestures well there they are thank you guys for watching don't forget to subscribe and click that little notification bell for future content on this device and i will see you guys in the next one peace